it's, it's 12.01, so we can uh, call the meeting to order. Um, I'm Michelle Lefebvre, uh, Chair of the Exemption Committee for uh, the Environmental Advisory Council. Better go around and uh, introduce themselves. Onauna? Okay, Onauna Thone, Exemption Committee member. Oh, okay, good. I wasn't on mute, sorry. <laughs> and um, here in uh, Environmental Review Program Central, uh, Tom Eisen and Keely Oshioka. And Jiping, if you would introduce yourself. I'm Jiping. I'm Jiping Faust, a uh, project manager uh, from School Facilities Authority. Great. Thank you so much. All right. Well, uh, first item on the agenda, I just had it open. Now it's disappeared. Was um, the two uh, exemption lists that we received. The first one was Department of Hawaiian Homelands. Um, like I said, we, we kept it on the agenda just because the discussion was, was ongoing. Uh, we sort of got to a point uh, when we were discussing it last time where we thought, well, maybe they could you know, consider restructuring the list rather than trying to do it uh, both you know, for the homeowners and for the agency, um, that it, you know, could they consider revising the list just to be uh, agency you know, actions rather than uh, lessees or, or homeowner uh, actions and haven't heard back yet. They were invited to this meeting. So I will uh, follow up. I really don't have any action or, or discussion beyond what, what we discussed last week, unless anyone else does. No, not, nothing on my end. Um, I understand that, you know, the changes we requested last to the SFA list have been made. Yes, yes. And so yeah, the next item was the SFA and, and Jiping sent me the, the revised list right after our meeting uh, last month. So we have the final list uh, attached and the edits were made. Um, so uh, the next step is to rec uh, recommend the list for um, concurrence to publish. So I guess we need a motion here to take it to the full council for approval. I'll move to um, recommend to the full council that school facilities authority lists be published for a 15 day comment period. Great. I second that. <laughs> <laughs> Members, thank you very much for, for responding so so quickly and, and giving us the, the revised list. So the next step is uh, at one o'clock, we'll bring it to the full council um, and recommend that it be published for the 15 day period. Um, I believe on the full council agenda, it's the, it follows the directors. Um, Correct. Yeah, so probably closer to like 108 or thereabout, we'll get to this agenda item, um, but it, it'll be early in our agenda. Yeah, so if you if you join at one, Jiping, then we should be done pretty, pretty soon. Uh, yeah. Okay, thank you very much. Yeah, yeah. Okay. We'll ask if anyone on that, on the full council has any questions, um, and if they do, you know, we can address them together and then um, uh, we'll uh, look for a motion to, for it to publish uh, to for the 15 days public review period. And, and Michelle, I think we actually do need to vote on the motion. Even though oh, sorry, sorry. Uh, yes, uh, all in favor. Thank you. Um, recommend to the full council. All right, both voted yes. Sorry, thank you. Um, okay. Any comments or questions uh, on that? Just thanks again for working on that. And um, yeah, we'll see We'll see you at one for the full council. So I, I mean, I guess in terms of process after that is, you know, the list gets published. Um, Tom, it'll, will it be in the 23rd or will it be in the, it'll be in the May 23rd edition of the environmental notice? Okay. So it gets published for a 15 day comment period. Um, if there's any public comments, you know, we'll go ahead and forward it to you folks for review as well as to the committee and you know make consideration of whether there are further changes that need to be made. Um, and you know, assuming no real substantive changes, we can probably get it on the agenda. I'm trying to think if it'll be on June 23rd, probably not for the June meeting, but for the July meeting for a full council concurrence. Tom, anything to add? Uh, no, I, your scheduling seems uh, right. And, okay. Uh, yes, moving forward. Okay, great. Okay, thank you so much. Oh, thank you. I'll see you again. 
Okay, yes. we'll see you at one. Yeah. Thank you. Okay, thank you. Uh, this is going to be a fast meeting. Um, <laughs> Yeah, I mean, I we could keep going through DHHL's list, but I, I don't know that that's very, um, no. not really a good use of our time, given we had kind of asked them for some pretty big structural reorganization and thought. So, yeah. yeah, yeah. I think waiting to hear what they're, you know, willing to do or yeah. you know, just still, still digesting it. So Right, right. Okay. So I'm taking a look at the minutes now. Okay. Yeah, we can take a minute to do that. I thought I had printed my agendas, but I think I only printed the full council agenda. So yeah, the March ones took us through this the second part of the list that we had gotten through. Right. Yeah, thanks for typing up some such detailed notes of our comments. You know, if if they do come back with it, well, it's a really good record. Yeah, between the February and the March uh, meeting minutes, it it details you know all the all the points we talked about. So. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And then April, yeah, I mean, I, 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 we started, you know, going point by point, but I think when we got to that larger discussion is when we sort of stopped going point by point. And right. To the part one type 10. Mm -hmm. Okay, well, I would say move to approve the March and April 2024 meeting minutes as drafted. Okay, I second. I guess we vote to approve the March. <laughs> yeah, I don't have any further discussion. Okay. okay, great. That is it for the agenda. Do we do we have any um anything else in the pipeline? Any other lists in the pipeline? I have not heard anything. Tom, have you received any other? Nothing right now. Okay. Yes. No. Okay. Yeah, Tom. I guess um. I know one of the things we were talking about on the full council agenda in the past couple of meetings was transition planning um, in terms of, you know, you know, what needs to be done for each committee. So for exemptions committee, um, Michelle, I think Ron gave you everything he had in terms of like every, the list of everybody or all the agencies that were reached out to over the last several years, who's responded, who hasn't. Um, so I think Maybe that's something just to be updated and on a regular basis of, um, of course, keeping track of like who, who we've been working with and what the council has been approving. And then if there's anybody else in particular that you as chair want to kind of nudge and say, hey, um, the other thing I know that we've talked about previously is, you know, do we do an update to the exemptions guidance? And I think we circulated that several meetings back, that little, I think it was a two page sheet that, um, excuse me, Scott and um, ERP had worked on, you know, back in 2019 when the rules came out. So I don't know that that needs refreshing um, just yet. I, I think it was a pretty good guide, but yeah, Tom, when, when you get a chance, maybe take a look at it. And if you think there's something that should be updated, um, can certainly bring that to the exemption committee to take a look at, um, if, especially if we don't have any, you know, lists in the pipeline. Yes, although I'm uh, not crystal clear as I sit here which exact document that is. So if you okay. have it, could you send it to me yeah. so I make sure that I'm looking at the same thing you're talking about? Let me find it again because I, I know we had, I thought we had circulated at a few meetings ago. Give me a second.
Uh, there... If you go guidance, yeah, ERP, and then guidance, and then there's the, it's under that. Under there which one? Oh, yeah, on the website. Okay. Mm -hmm. Thank you. I was like, okay. I know we looked at it recently. Put in the chat, too. Okay. Oh, yeah. Thank you. If you can put it in the chat, that'd be great. Yeah. Okay, yep, that's the one. Mm -hmm. Tom, do you do you have it? She put the um Michelle put the link in in the chat. Yeah. There are comments. We didn't have ERP no. didn't have comments to it. Uh, okay, I see it. I will. Uh, I may have looked at it before, but I'll look at it again. Okay. Yeah. I mean, at minimum, I think the heading needs to be changed and the the logo from OEQ mm. to the ERP. Um, so maybe just those kind of those kind of references. So this this was a file you know Scott had. I don't know Tom if you have access to the original Word doc at all because I'm happy to take a crack at you know revising it. Um, I I'll have to look to see. Okay. I haven't been dealing with these, so it's not sure, on the sure. top of my mind. So um, right, right, right. I don't know what there is. Uh, some of the stuff he had, he dumped a lot of it, but. It's, okay. I think not everything. Sure, so sure. Yeah, if you, I don't want you to spend like a month looking for it. I mean, if it's something you can easily search the files, and if you find kind of the word copy, then we we can adjust. Um, Just skimming it while we're talking, yeah, it's got the old uh, OEQC web uh, email address under step seven. Yeah, submit an exemption list. So, like you're saying, logo, the email, the agency. Yeah. Name. So, at yeah. least refreshing that stuff and then I guess we can take a closer look if there's any other um, right. explanations and whatnot that that we'd want to yeah. kind of revise from there so yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah if you and if you found it Tom and just sent it to us then Onona and I could take a crack to it at making the edits you know and track changes mm -hmm. okay, I'll look to see for a word document there's okay a okay. lot, but I'll look for that. Sure, yeah. sure. I'm, I'm sure. If there not, are. we can we can also recreate some of it. I mean, some of it. Yeah, yeah. We 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 could do that as well. Yeah. Figure. Let Let's check to see if we have the original file first, mm -hmm. and before we do that. But okay. Okay. Um. It's a PDF, not the word. Okay. I don't have anything else. Okay. Me either. Not today. Okay, so then when we take it to the full council, we're looking for a motion to publish the list for the public review. Is that so right? Is that it's, a, it's a recommendation out of council. Recommendation yeah. out of council. Uh, out of committee, I'm sorry. Yes, out of committee to the council. So now we are looking, no, then. So I, I, the way we do it is, I mean, that that is the motion essentially from the committee, right? Mm -hmm. From the committee is a recommendation out of committee mm -hmm. to council, which we did. So then when we take it to council, we're recommending it to be published and we're looking for a motion from the council. No, to... it's already the motion because it's 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 the motion from the committee, right? Got yeah, it. essentially a recommendation so, from the committee. Mm -hmm. So then what are we asking? I guess what I'm asking <laughs> what well, ask the council for. Well, yeah, I guess going back, gosh, I for procedure, I, I think it is, yes. right? We don't we don't need a new motion from the gotcha. council, do we Tom? I think that is I think that is the motion. So I think Michelle, you're you'd make that motion, right? I'm making the motion. Yeah, I think that's okay. it. I know we I know okay. we don't need a second because it's a rec yeah, I know that. <laughs> Sorry, go ahead. Say it Tom. Again. All right, Tom, you were saying something? That makes sense to me that um, um Michelle makes the motion. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, and I, I know, and I know we don't need a second because it is a recommendation from the committee. So. We don't need a second 
to the motion. To the motion. Gotcha. Gotcha. Okay. In count in committee, we don't need a second. No, we count. do in committee, but because committee. this is a recommendation coming from the committee, like that's the motion to the council. We don't need it to be seconded. The council can just vote on it. Understood. Right. Mm -hmm. So I'm moving to recommend that we publish. Yeah, I mean the motion. The motion is publicate that, that it be approved by the council for publication, right? Okay. 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 Just learning the terminology. I know it's <laughs> it's all formalities and. No, no, no. I want I want to do it. Yeah. Yeah. They're, I mean, committee is recommending, right? And so that's the yeah. motion. Let's just say that's the motion. Okay. I can jump in. Okay. Okay. Well, that's all we had today. So uh, if no one has anything else, uh, then we will uh, adjourn the meeting. It's 12, 17 p.m. and we'll see you at one o'clock. Thank you. Thank you. Bye.